um, the space. Um, we, uh, this is gonna feel like a beach. Um, in fact, there's probably gonna be a sand dune, there'll be some reeds. Um, up there will actually be the lifeguard chair. Um, uh, but it's also the inside of a restaurant and it's also the inside, wherever it is, and lighting's gonna help us shift from those. Any questions from anybody before we start? No? All right, well, let's just uh, <coughs> read this thing, shall we? A woman stands alone on a stage. I'm not one of those people who has difficulty communicating. It's not something I have trouble with. It's the, um, it's the first day of rehearsal of, uh, of uh, the first play in the 21st season here at the Blank, uh, Dusk Rings a Bell by Stephen Belber. Um, and uh, I'm directing it. I'm Daniel Henning. And I'm really excited that I have these two amazing actors um, who have agreed to be a part of this. Um, Taya Gill will be playing Molly. And Josh Randall will be playing Ray. And uh, we just did a read through, and they're amazing. Uh -huh. It's the first day of rehearsal. <laughs> I have to imagine where we'll be in five weeks. <laughs> we have a good director. <laughs> uh, one of the things that struck me about the play was <clears throat> uh, the character I'm playing, Ray, uh, ends up going to, to prison for 10 years for being passively involved in the hate crime. And it's interesting to me on, on many levels, but one of the things that's particularly interesting is how uh, I think we can all identify or look back in our past and identify with um, a moment, identify a moment where we weren't courageous as, as we would have liked to have been, or as strong as we would have liked to have been. Um, and it just so happens this particular character, that moment for him is uh, enormous consequences on his life and, and others. One of the things that I, that I really love about this play is that it talks about the moment in our past when there was possibility. Um, and uh, I think we've all had that. I think we've all had some moment of feeling that in our lives. And um, it then brings these two people together in that moment and then sends them off into their separate lives for 25 years. And they come back again and, uh, and are trying to rediscover that possibility. The, the tragedy and the, um, the sadness and the joy of the sands of time, really, for mm -hmm. me, this play represents. 